Hey everyone, um, today we're going to be testing out something new. I actually got this at Bed Bath & Beyond um, for 10 bucks, and um, it's actually called Erase Your Face and it was 10 bucks for four towels. Um, I was a little bit upset when I got home and I realized that it wasn't like the actual name brand uh, makeup eraser. but. I thought I'd try it out anyways. Sorry for the bad lighting, I'm actually in the bathroom because um, obviously it's a makeup remover so I gotta remove my makeup. I've been wearing this makeup since I believe nine this morning and it is now 11.50 p.m. So it's time to go to bed. Um, the little kit actually came with four towels that came with a black a blue, a purple, and a pink. And I think today I'm going to use the blue. So the only thing that I have done is on the directions it actually says to wash them before you use them probably for sanitary reasons because of whatever chemicals are on them in production. And this says, meet your new best friend. Introducing the Erase Your Face Cleansing Cloth, a makeup remover like no other. It says these re reusable makeup removing cloths are for sen or reusable makeup removing cloth for sensitive skin. So I guess if you don't have sensitive skin, you can't use it. I don't know. And it says for the ultimate convenience, four cloths are included. Ideal for traveling. And this is how to use machine wash before first use, which is what I did, and then dampen cloth with warm water and gently wipe away makeup. And then for the care instructions, just machine wash, blah, 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 and she's got a little picture of this lady, I guess, removing her face. Just for funsies, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to um, remove half my face with the cloth and then uh, half with uh, this makeup cleansing tissue that I got from a hotel. Fun. Anyway, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm just going to go ahead and take my glasses off. I can't see anything right now, really, but I'm going to go ahead and moisten, moisten the cloth with some warm water, so. Oh my gosh, these are, these are really hard to get wet. Okay, this is a little alarming. I washed them in my washer and just sweating them, they smell like chemicals, I'm not even gonna lie. Ooh, ow, ah, I just burnt my toe. <laughs> Don't do this at home, this is dangerous. Guys, I legitimately just burnt myself. <laughs> It says that this cloth has the ability to remove all types of cosmetics, including waterproof mascara, which is convenient because today I actually chose to wear waterproof mascara. It says it'll be sure to give you a fresh and clean feeling. So we'll see how fresh and clean I'm feeling after I use this. So I'm just going to start off on, um, I'm going to use the regular makeup wipe on this side that I got from the hotel because I'm cheap and, you know... And then this side with the makeup cloth with the erase your face um, cloth. And I even, I even have a, a lip gloss on or a liquid lipstick on today. That's a pretty long lasting one. So we'll see how well it removes that. All right. So let's get started. Okay. It's, it's saving makeup off. That's for sure. But I don't feel like it's actually taking off any of my mascara. I really don't. So we'll see. It's not doing a dang thing to this lip gloss either. So. Okay, there it's starting to take some of the lip gloss off. It's definitely taking makeup off, like I said, like, I mean, you can see it's disgusting, so. Moving along. Okay, this is, like, dragging on my skin a lot, like, it's very pulley. Um, let's see if I can do it with the other side of it. Does it, yep, still feels the same. Okay. Mm. 
I'm just like manually in my cat fans and glasses on. I'm just pretending. Okay. Zoom in for you guys. I don't know if you can see, but I mean, it, it definitely took the makeup off. I don't think it actually took any of my mascara off because I don't see any of it on this cloth. But it took it off, but it also left a bunch of fuzzies on my face. It definitely didn't take any of my mascara off. Anyways, we'll go ahead and clean with this and I'll let you guys see that. Ooh, this smells like cucumber. The only reason I thought to do this was because I ran out of my regular makeup wipes and being a lazy person that I am, I decided to just use these and I thought I'd film it for you guys. So. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and finish washing my face and I'll come back and let you guys know what I think. Okay, so I'm back. Um, I finished washing my face and all that jazz like I normally do. Um, actually, I'll put my glasses back on. So, just my, you know, first thoughts on this is that... I mean, it's a really cool product and it's really cheap. For 10 bucks, you get the four cloths as opposed to the actual original um, makeup eraser that I thought that I was buying is 20 bucks. So um, don't ask how I thought that I was buying it. I, mom brain. Um, anyways, I think it cleans really well. It definitely doesn't get the waterproof mascara off like it says it did but it did get everything else off really well. I mean, they, both sides feel, you know, feel really clean comparably, you know, before I washed my face, they both felt the same. So, um, there's that. Um, I think it's worth it. I mean, especially, you know, if you're like me and you run out of your makeup removers and you don't want to go out and buy more or you have to order them and, you just need something quick and clean, quick to clean. Um, anyways, uh, that's all I have to say about it. Definitely worth the 10 bucks that you spend on it and you can get it at your local Bed Bath & Beyond. So, um, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.